gazing over this magnificent panorama of Epsom Downs, the first consideration this year is the weather. After weeks of drought, there are rain clouds overhead, but they did not deter the eager crowds who made the annual pilgrimage to see the derby. Just before the start, the weather was mainly fair, and you could hear the song of the lark. Card, race card, card, city card, city race card. Put a main for racing today and win yourself a packet. On the derby, on the derby, no one on the derby. The first big thrill of the 155th derby was the arrival of the royal party. It is many years since our king had a horse entered for this greatest of all races, but this year license will carry the royal colours. For this reason, there was even more than the usual enthusiasm on the arrival of the king and queen, with Queen Mary and other members of the royal family. The king and queen, escorted by Lord Lonsdale, walked over the course to the paddock before the parade, and at this time the sun was shining. Everything seemed to be set for a fine weather derby. Now the parade, 22 runners led by the King's Horse Licence, followed by Pound, Foolish and Caveman. And here is Pash, the favourite, with Gordon Richards up. Now they're in line for the start, and they're off. Chatsworth on the inside, then Pash, then Licence. And with the horses, the rain started. Round the first bend, Halcyon Gift on the rails with Jockey and Whitecap is coming up to the lead. Then Chatsworth, number 10, goes up with Mannerite and Mirza, the second into a line of three behind Halcyon. The pace is terrific as they come towards Tattenham Corner. Corner. Halcyon Gift still leading, thundering round like a winner. Lengths ahead of Chatsworth with Pash and Scottish Union getting into stride for the run into the finish. Halcyon Gift is fading now. In the straight, it's Scottish Union come up to the lead. Then next to him is Pash with Gordon Ritters making a terrific effort. Out of the blue comes Boirussell. Watch that speed on the nearest coat as he comes to the finishing post. The finish in slow motion. Boirussell pulls out to win by four lengths. Scottish Union second, Pash third, Pound Foolish fourth. French horse wonderfully ridden by Elliot and led in proudly by his owner, Mr. P. Beatty, a 20 to 1 winner for the 1938 Derby. <laughs>